welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be testing and um, not unboxing, but like opening the Barry M highlighting palette. So I actually picked this up in Boots yesterday. It was a very like, I didn't mean to buy it like everything. Like every time you go into Boots, things just like fall into your hands. Don't know how it happens, but you just walk in that shop and like products just sort of like gravitate towards you. And before you know it, you've walked out the shop like, how much did I spend? Why did I buy that? <laughs> so yeah, I went in for a foundation and I came out with a highlight palette. Like, okay, so today I'm gonna swatch it and open it and just test it because why not? I think the main reason, like I've not actually tried, I don't think I've tried any Barry M makeup products before, like ever. <laughs> so the main reason that I picked this up was because of the packaging it's kind of like holographic so that drew me towards it more than anything else I think that was that was what drew me towards it so I don't know how it's going to be I don't know if it's going to be any good it was $6.99 it might be $7.99 um I will pop it on the screen though whichever price is correct so inside whoa that looks like okay we've got one that is slightly cracked but it's okay <laughs> You get six different shades. Are they cream? I don't know if they are, but these two look like they might be cream highlighters. Um, but I don't know. It's a shame because the one that's cracked is the one that looks like I'm most excited to try. But anyway, peel the film off and pop that there. And then it's also got another layer on top. Oh, it's such a shame because that is really badly cracked, but so, oh, there's actually films across all of them. Maybe I should have cut the film on that one to stop it going everywhere. <laughs> okay, that was a double film, I think. I see, yeah, there's a double film across each of them. This one looks like it's gonna be really pretty. I am getting the highlighter everywhere. Oh, so it is cream. Is this supposed to be a highlighter? I want to, I'm really confused. I want to swatch them for you. Hmm. I just, I don't know. I'm not feeling the cream ones. Um, I'm a bit deflated actually. Like I don't have all my makeup brushes um, at the new house. So I'm going to have to use my fingers because I don't have any that are clean. But so I hope you don't mind. That one looks really, really nice. Oh, see, I don't, you, can you even see? I don't think you can see the first two at all. You can kind of only just see them like in person. I mean, this one you can see and that one looks really, really nice. Oh, that one that's broken. That one is really nice also. And then again, the other two are just cream and I'm really not a fan of those. I mean, this one actually, I think that would be really nice. So that's this one here. Obviously it's not gonna suit me, um, but that is a really nice. I think that would be really, really good. Basically, so I'm going to do the two powder ones. I'm gonna try this one on this side and I'll do the pink one on the other side. So. Let's just pop that there. Ooh, this, <laughs> I don't know how that's looking on camera, but in this mirror, it looks purple, which is very, it's just not what I expected. Um, oh, it is, it's looking like purple. And then let's go on this side. Oh, I like this one. That one is very pretty. Let's pop a bit on my nose and just down there. Oh, this one does, um, this one here at the bottom does reflect the light so well, but like I said, it looks purple. I feel like this particular shade would be really good for like, oh, what's the word? Like a space girl look, like that type of thing. You know, like the shiny, like holographic. Um, I don't know if that's the, Space Girl is what I'm looking for, but hopefully you know what I mean. I mean, honestly, 
I just don't think it's like the right color highlight for me. <laughs> Can you see what I mean? Like it is very like purpley, like purpley blue, but I don't know. <laughs> My nose is like the highlight is proper standing out there. Um, but it looks good. It looks really good as a nose highlight. And then let's look at this side. This side is definitely a much more like natural um, highlight. Like I said, I haven't got my highlight, like what I would usually use um, for highlight. I haven't got those brushes at this house. They're still at my parents. So I'm really sorry that I'm having to use my fingers. You can see there though, like how much they glow. It's just a shame about the others. Oh, this powder is going everywhere. I've literally got highlight all over my brand new black jeans. I'm gonna wrap this video up really quickly before the rest of this falls all over me. I mean, unfortunately I would not rate the outer two like at all. I think it's because I'm just not, I don't know. I just, I'm just not finding them. If you can look at the swatches, the only two you can really see are these two here and they are the powder ones. I mean, the rest are just, <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't know. They're just not for me. I'm just not a fan of cream highlighters. Um, as for these two, they are really good. Um, you know, it does the job. It is definitely, you can definitely, definitely see it. Those middle two definitely get the thumbs up. <laughs> right, okay. I'm gonna wrap this up because I really need to clean this mess that is on my lap. I can't believe these jeans. Today's the first day that I've worn these jeans and that cracked palette it's just gone everywhere. I'm not, <laughs> anyway. This really needs to be blended in a lot better. I am fully aware, but for testing purposes, we were just whacking it on my face. <laughs> oh well, the other two, however, the two in the middle, I would give a thumbs up, but yeah, <laughs> okay. That is everything. I'm gonna go and clean this mess. I hope you've enjoyed this video anyway, and I will see you very soon.